It's the final number. We're very thank you, thankful for y'all be having us, and I don't know where the hell this accent came from. California, gotta get there Saturday night Now credit card Gas up in Turlock Tall beef jerk Come along for the ride Hours Pass like scenery And your words They keep coming back to mind You said Cause you know me Why well, say Motel, El Tropicana, exit 37 on that frontage road. Check in, time for a shower, dry off and get down and down to the church. Well, the new shirt, stiff on the collar, new shoes, hurt my feet. Church side, wedding in progress. Reverend says, woman, will you take this man in the usher? Sits me down on the bright side. Row 7, I'm 29 And while I'm sitting and sitting watching Your words that keep coming back to mind You said, did you know me? Well, I said, what's that I know? I'm the one who got away I'm the one, I'm the one who got away Later, the bride, she's making time on the reception, reception line. The bridegroom, he's drunk as a lord. He's eating roast beef. He's drinking sparkling wine. He's drinking. 
drinking is drinking sparkling wine. Big slices of prime rib. Kind of salty on the outside, but cooked low and slow so it's pink and fatty. And he's drinking the sparkling wine. That's zecht for our German friends. Good morning, Germans. Enjoying your morning coffee? Enjoying your chibo? I never understood those Chivo stores. They sell coffee, coffee makers, and women's underwear. Can we say that on the radio? It's weird. But my mind, it travels back. So this was, you know, you go to these weddings, and it brings out the best behavior. It brings out the best in human beings, these weddings. No, no. Oh, no. Absolutely the best. And, you know, there's all these gifts that people can't afford. Ostentatious pieces of material whatever that they bestow on people. But they don't come. They don't come without some kind of grip. Some sort of attachment. At this particular wedding... Uncle Harry, he bestowed a satellite dish. Now, you know this is some years back because Uncle Harry, he had that satellite dish, one just like it on his RV. And he was space trucking. So Uncle Harry, he's taking back that satellite dish, and that's all right by me, because at this point, at this point, everyone's passed out, lit up or loaded. And so someone comes up with the... comes up with the idea. Someone comes up with the brilliant concept. Going back to the days of the CV radio. And it's Convoy back to the motel. I said it's Convoy back to the motel. Convoy back to the motel in the hot tub with all my clothes. Down to make this very short, succinct tale just a little bit longer. I must tell you that I was in a pastel yellow fit lapel tuxedo smoking jacket, a la Cary Grant, crossed with uh, Sherwin, Sherwin Williams or Martha Stewart or something. So it was in the hot tub with all my clothes. But meanwhile, I'm still thinking about those words you said to me. You said, get to know me. Well, I said, what's up to know? I'm the one who got away. I'm the one, I'm the one who got away. I'm the one who got away. I'm a one who got, 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 got away Got away 
But wait, but wait, but wait. But fellas, wait. Don't go so. Don't go so. Don't go so fast. Over here on the bass guitar, ladies and gentlemen. This is Mr. Mike Baker, recently of West Hills, California. Probably earlier this evening and, and likely later this morning. here on the kick drum it's Mr. Dave Drury my close personal friend for over 30 years no, I've known you that long I match it yeah, we met first but didn't meet and then we met again and I can't remember where I met Kirk Swan over here on the guitar I think it was it was was it at the rat? The rat or CBGB's. And then at CBGB's and then at the Peppermint Lounge. Yeah. I think the first place I saw a dump truck was at CBGB's. During uh, one of those music things. Probably the new music seminar. Replacements? Replacements? I don't know if they were on the... No, I think it was kind of a Boston-y bill. The Neats? Mmm, the Neighborhoods. It was the Neats and the Replacements. Oh, okay. I don't remember. to thank y'all Well this leads on Two hours later the bride She's making time in the reception line And the bridegroom He's drunk as a lord And he's eating roast beef He's drinking that sparkling wine Meanwhile, I'm still thinking about those words you said to me. You said, get to know me. <laughs> 